hey what is up YouTube welcome back to another video in this video I am going to be doing a tutorial on Cyberlink's Power Director 365 their speech to text function now what you're looking at right here on your screen is the interface of Power Director 365 this is the media pool up here I have uh, some cl clips up here I'm gonna drop this down into the timeline I'm going to click this right this button right here to view the entire video okay and um, to enable this speech to text let's go into the uh, CC subtitle room so you want to click that that will bring up this uh, three options here speech to text create subtitles manually and import subtitles but I'm going to be uh, doing the speech to text function. So what I want to do is click on this and that's going to analyze this audio clip and turn the words from the subject here into speech or text on the screen that you can see. So let's let me go ahead and click this. And OK, one other thing, this is going to bring up this dialogue, this screen right here all audio tracks audio track one English uh, Japanese traditional Chinese Japanese of course I'm going to choose English uh, you have your audio audio length and now I'm going to click on uh, create so it'll analyze the audio in this clip this is a short clip so it's not going to take that longer if you have a longer clip it's going to take a little longer Okay, well now what we have here is the uh, subtitle text. This is what the program interprets the uh, words and it's put it into text. So I'm going to go ahead and um, play back this and see how, play back some of this uh, and see how it does so far. All right, y'all, that will bring the conclusion of this video. This has been a look at the small rig extension grip for the Sony ZV E10 okay right here uh, I want to point out something the correct um, words for this is the E10 should be Edward this E is right it should be number the number one and zero not TIN but this program allows you to go in to correct this you go back into the subtitle text and you can click right here and you can actually edit this turn it to e 10 like that then you can go back down here and as you can see it corrected this right here i'm going to go back about right here let me take this back a little bit only zv e10 see it corrected and I the corrected purpose it. the purpose of the purpose of this grip is to for me two things provides an extension of this grip okay let's go over some of the um well let me play back a little bit more brings it down a little bit more for your pinky and also it will allow you to mount your camera on the tripod okay uh doing a pretty good job doing a pretty good darn good job now um let's take a look at uh some of the uh options that you have up here in this uh, subtitle text, uh, this room, subtitle room. Uh, you can change, you can actually go back in here, you can go in here and change the uh, fonts and different colors of this text. Let's go ahead and uh, let me give you an example. Let's click this text icon, put this right here. Now, this is currently on Arial. So as you can see in here, you have a ton of different font options in here. Uh, let's change one to mm, let's do impact uh, okay you can change the 3d depth on this uh, do it right there put it about put that about right there uh, you have color picker tools in here you can change the uh, you can add a shadow you can add a border you can change the color of the border I'll change the border to red um, text I'll keep it white shadow I'll keep that there and you can take this color picker tool let's change the shadow to 
Ah, green. Do that. You can, act, you can actually play this back on through the here like that. But I'm going to take this back a little bit about right there. You can change that to green. Okay. The shadow to green. All right. Um, what else? What else can we do? You can do the style bold. You can change the size of this. Uh, we do 18. <clears throat> Then you can click apply or you can click OK. If you would just OK is just if you want to do just this one uh, area of this text right here or you can click apply to all. And as you can see, it did that right there, as you can see, and then you can go back right here and it's done this to all A bit more for your pinky. And also. Let's change this one. I don't really like this font right there. Let's go back into here and uh, change that again. Change it to non bold. Regular. And apply to all. That's better. I like that better. It will allow you to mount your camera on the tripod vertically, along with mounting your camera. Now, if you want to, uh, if you see a mistake in, in here, you can either, it's like if it doesn't interpret the spelling of something, if it doesn't get the uh, text right, you can always click on here or you can click up here to do the correction. You can click down here and you can do the correction up here. You can type whatever, if this is not up here correctly, if it misinterpreted the, the uh, text up here for something, some other words you can go up here and correct it but that's fine uh, let's go up here and see some other options in this subtitle room uh, these are some um, subtitle editing tips these are tips up here you can pause this if you want to I'll close that speech to text import titles subtitles to SRT TX file export you can you know you can you can see this right here uh, merge subtitles you can split a subtitle delete the selected subtitle marker you can add a subtitle marker right here so just different options you can do a search you can put a uh, something in here uh, so for example I'll type in grip grip and hit and hit enter and as you can see down here it found grip in yellow and grip in red right here I'm not looking for that so a lot of options in here let me play a little bit more of this is to for me two things it provides an extension of this so I think this does a, a darn good job the uh, recap of the video this is a tutorial on how to use um, cyberlinks Power Director 365's their text, their speech to text feature. Grip brings it down a little bit more. I think it's very nice. Um, I can definitely see myself using this. Uh, there could be many. This is definitely a game changer. This will save you a lot of time. And, uh, and you know, also, if you want, uh, text from speech on here or speech to text it will allow you to mount your camera on the tripod very very vertically. very very nice I I definitely like this feature very nice uh, if you like videos like this tutorials and uh, if you want to see more videos like this tutorials on different things of cyberlinks power director 365 I will leave the link in the description if you want to um, download this program if you want to edit your videos um, if you want to see more tutorials on Cyberlinks Power Director 365, uh, leave it in the comments. If you're new to my channel, consider subscribing. Uh, give this video a thumbs up if you like it and found it informative. And until the next video, peace out, y'all.